What's going on, gang? Today, Friday, show day weekend video. So um, it is now five to nine. I've been up since half six, running around, not running around, but just getting things done. Um, so I didn't start the vlog till now. We are about to get first meal in. I've checked in with Cuba, done 2,000 steps. Um, we have a little bit of a predicament today in terms of we are 87 kilo up on weight, um, weighing, um, I have to weigh in at under 89 kilos, so I have to be careful obviously with food intake, water intake to make sure I'm below the uh, weight cap. Um, obviously it's not too, it's, we're not too close, but all they say is prolonged first meal, which is right now, cream of rice, some berries, dark chocolate, some whey in there as well. So you can get this in now at nine o'clock. I've cooked my rice for today and potato for today um, to be go ready to go down with. Um, and then I sh all I need to do now is cook some cream rice for the rest of the day today. Um, and then prepare some meals for tomorrow morning pre-show and then we are good food wise. Um, it's a bit of a manic one trying to get everything sorted to go because I've made sure you've got your, all your food, um, your trunks, all your stuff to stay in the hotel with, extra bed sheets, um, yourself, extra, everything that you, you're going to need you have to take with you because obviously the plan always changes, you never know what you're going to need so it's a bit of a stressful um, sort of day to obviously morning to get things ready. We're leaving about half twelve hopefully, fingers crossed. Sun is out now doing some errands, go and see, get some something from mum's house. Um, fill the car up, some parcels, whatever. Um, we say half twelve, but hopefully we'll be on the road by at least one o'clock. Two hours down there, checking it free um, to the hotel. Um, I believe someone's got some work left to do still. And then, tan four forty, register. Then it's feet up, chill. Boom. Gonna take you with me. Get as much footage as I can without getting stressed out with the camera. Um, because obviously you need to keep the stress as low as possible so when I get a chance I'll put the camera up, do some bits and pieces if it stresses me out I'll put it down and just crack on but for now, meal one, let's get it boy. So we have spare bed sheets travel down outfit um, tanning outfit, some clo extra clothes, pants, socks, um, t-shirt for afterwards, some tracksuit bottom just in case, importance of a laptop, GoPro, all its, all its um, bits and pieces, four pairs of trunks, clippers, some tablets, deodorant, um, inhaler just in case. I think this will cover me for now. Um, obviously we need to take battery pack, uh, extension leave all the charges on as well. Um, so I'm gonna whackle this into my little suitcase. And that is um, clothes wise, I think I'm covered. Um, there's not too much I've tried to do it like logically, okay, what I'm going to travel down in, what I'm going to need when I get there. Da, 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 da. Main thing, bed sheets, that's why that costs you an arm and a leg in hotel fees after because <laughs> they love to sting you with it. <laughs> Plenty of room. So, we have um, meals for today. Obviously, some cream rice added as well. I had one meal of cream rice already. Um, then eight grams of rice, eight grams of rice, eight grams of rice, some chicken, um, some veg underneath each of them, fringe grams of potato, and some chicken on that as well. Probably just add some lettuce to that later on when we get to wherever we, uh, the hotel and stuff. Um, easy meals for now. I've got some cream of rice to cook to take with me as well, and then we will be boom done for today. And then I'll sort out tomorrow's meals as well, which I'll have to cook in the hotel. Um, just kettle and whip it whip that, whip it at a wrist. Um, for cream and rice tomorrow. Some dark chocolate to add to this meal, um, some dark chocolate to add to my cream and rice meal for some fats, um, and then obviously, as per, we have the salt allowance for the day as well. <sighs> so, I think I'm a little bit ahead of time. For me personally, I've got all my stuff sorted. Clothes sorted, food sorted, just the last little couple bits and pieces to do. So I'm gonna take a half hour chill now, keep my feet up, relax, um, and then we shall go make my last cream of rice meal, or two, two cream of rice meals to go, um, and be good to go. Summer should be back soon, and she will be running around like a headless chicken. And then at, once, at some point in the day, I'll probably be like, remember that half hour I laid down for? Yeah, I probably shouldn't have. But right now, YouTube and chill. Brought sat a prep present. Prep present. Prep present. <laughs> My favourites. <laughs> Blue Crocs. <laughs> <laughs> because I literally wear them every day. She's been moaning about having the she had white ones and they're all dirty. Yeah, they are. They're getting, getting all a bit grubby. So now she's got some black ones. It's winter now, so I need black. 
So that's all my meal today cooked now. All I do is add some um, frozen base to that when it comes round to it. Um, it seems to be a big one, and I just obviously weighed it, expecting them to, and away they go. All systems go. Um, some of us in the shower, then we are pretty much ready to crack on. Um, zero stress so far. So far, so good. Zero stress. Drying out as the day's going on, and feeling better. Um, so we will continue on. Um, I like to say, I've got to weigh myself before every meal, so it's 20 to 12 now. Gonna give it 10 15 minutes, weigh myself, um, check on the queue, make sure everything is good. Um, have another one of these cream rice meals, add some berries, and away we go. Then we should get in the car and travel down. It's coming, it's slowly coming together. Someone's got our food done some rices, yogurt, sauces. Chicken, lettuce, rice, extra lettuce, some of those signature le um, tunas, some protein yogurt, it's just for ease of life. All my food and her food going in the back here. Someone tell the people, how are you feeling? No. Oh, bad lighting, bad no. lighting, bad lighting. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, feeling alright, feeling, making sure that I've got everything. But I think we have more importantly, you've got everything. I could buy anything I need, so. Yeah, good to go, I think. Nervous. Nervous? Not Ooh. nervous, Ooh. like... It's like that exciting nervous feeling that you have in your stomach. You know how I get when you get on stage, so... So, making, a, so making so many stops for the road, um, and then, because I'm still obviously limited to drink, I'm still just sipping water, stops coming up. Come on. Oh, shit. Did you get that? No, don't. <laughs> Can we do that again? So we're in the car, we have an hour and 55 minutes on the maps. I am driving the chariot today because Summer has some work to get done. Um, she said she'll drive, but I said, let me drive and then you get some work done now. It means we're gonna probably have a better chill later tonight. Um, so hour 55 means we'll get there at 10 to three, check in at three, um, weigh myself straight away, see what weight is, maybe get a meal in. Um, and then 10 is at 20 to five. And then register, then it's chill for the day. So let's get this drive on. Been doing. Man's gotta do what man's gotta do. Empty the tank. Yes, people. So just got to the hotel, uh, checked in. Got a, like a just a um, proper small, average sized holiday in room. Um, really small, simple bathroom. Um, first things first. Weighed in. Went for a shit, went for a piss. Um, <laughs> we are coming in hot! Um, so my weight to the cube, which was 88.7. 87.8. Um, so we're still okay. Um, next meal, cold cream of rice on bed. Um, I have, we just took some pictures to be fair, I've sent to Cuba. Getting tighter, getting drier, um, and we are definitely getting better. My aim now is just to stay as relaxed and chilled as possible. Um, so Summer has gone to the shop because dum dum, forgot the bed sheets, got them out, took them downstairs, just didn't put them in the car. So either I have put them in the car and I've not seen them, or I forgot to put them in the car. But pictures gone to Cuba. I don't know if you can see that. Nice and tight. So we are looking good at the minute. I've got about an hour-ish um, before I go to get my tan and register. So I'm just going to get this meal in now, have a bit more water, see what Cuba says, and then we shall reassess and go from there. But all in all, good, 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 chilled, relaxed, nice drive down, only one stop here, checked in. This is the hotel, the who's who's of hotel, all judges are here. I've already seen face I know, said loads of people that I know. Um, so it's going to be having everyone staying because it's so close to the venue. So meal in chill um i'm gonna try maybe nap for half hour get a nap and then we should go get the tan on and reggie star but that's it for now peace crop gun <laughs> 
Time to go to town. Food bag. Or body builder. Six pack. Crocs on. <laughs> so we've made weight, um, way under six pound under on their scales. Um, so very happy. I went for two pieces before. Um, so I tanned first. Went, I had two pieces before I checked in. So way under. Um, so now I get the food in, get the water in, let everything set in. Tanned up, tanned up. Um, back to the hotel. Getting some food in now quickly. Back to the hotel. Chill. Feet up. Relax. What time is it? Twenty-five six. Twenty-five six. Got a nice chilled night now. Someone's got a bit of work to get finished, then we can just relax and we can watch the boxing. Connor Ben, my boy Connor Ben, he's not my boy, but I feel like he is because I feel like I know him. Um, watch Connor Ben, chill, sleep, get ready for tomorrow. So, meal in, back to the hotel, should catch you guys there. Yes, people, so. So, night time now, uh, half eight, all the food is in, all the drink is in, pretty much all the water is in. We have boxing on the, um, the laptop, soccer on the TV. I am wrapped in a single duvet uh, cover, just in a single duvet cover. Um, been and got a pillowcase as well. Everything's done, hard work's done, just chilling now. Feel mad relaxed, that's the whole point, that's the best part of it. Um, alarm set for half four in the morning, book pictures, um, see what the plans with Cuba and then go from there. So that is um, pre show day done, wrapped up, finished. Tomorrow it's show day, so for now, lights out, all out whatever Paddy says. So it's 4.58, alarm went off at uh, 4.30, up, pictures been taken, sent to Cuba, um, and we are looking on, so get nice and close to that, that's the condition right now, flatten off a little bit, you want some water and some food in, so I'm now making cream of rice um, at a boiling kettle, just mix it up in, in, a, in a tub here, um, cream of rice meal, one going in now, proper bodybuilder life, eh? Get this meal in, um, and then we shall have to take pictures every hour, uh, every meal before, um, every time before we have a meal, we send some pictures to Cuba, see what the crack is for the rest of the, of the uh, plan. But realistically, there's probably about five hours now between now and stage time, um, so not long left. Just try and get some glycogen back in, some water back in, just to fill out a little bit. Well, not glycogen, get some water back in, some card back in, just to fill out a little bit, um, and then we will be going time. So, gonna get this in, see how it tastes. It might taste like absolute shit, but get this in, get the carbs in. Some fats in through chocolate, and then we are go. It is now half six. 50 minutes, we'll do some more pictures, um, send across to Cuba, and then see what the plan is from there. Another meal go in. Um, tan, we're going to leave it about half seven for the tan, and then we shall, um, once we leave it, we'll just stay in, stay in the venue. Like I say, it won't be on too late to be fair, it's going to be about half nine ish. I'll be on the stage, so um, 15 minutes chilling in bed, feet up, and then we shall take some more pictures, go again. Bring it up. Jeez. is on parents come to the rescue because we have now battery in the gopro tan is on second coach all done oh, okay. um, got in nice and early so it is now what time is it it's quarter past eight um i think i'm gonna get some a little bit more food in um and get it so we can get that time to settle um and it's just chill out now Hiya. someone's ready to go in the car sheets on the there so get some pictures done send them to, over to cuba now and then we shall see where we're at from there Cameras. Meeting cameras. Okay, what's happening? Good. That's okay. right. How's it going? Good. How's it going, Jake? Backstage now. Uh, chilling, feet up, legs up. Cuba's got videographers left, right, and centre. There's lads everywhere pumping up, chilling, getting the stuff done. Now for me, I'm a little bit early back here, so I'm just relaxing, legs up, chilling. Almost go time. Um, pump up. Now we're about there to be fair, so we'll see you on stage. Here he is. <laughs> The man that's upsetting all the supers, causing an uproar by coming in. Why don't you smash it? Up in the car park, mate. That's it. You look glazed up, man. Can I talk to the people, tell them how do you feel. We came, 
We took part. And hopefully, we did some damage. Definitely, yeah. definitely done this some damage. Is, this for me and me and the main man behind the camera. To be fair, you should be. You should have this on yourself because you're way better looking than I am. But <laughs> um, we took. We turned up the most humble and hardworking guys in the game. There's no paper bodybuilders on. Fucking live this shit day in day out. Which is why we're going to continue to progress. Because you know what? Whatever happens today, whatever the outcome, it is only the beginning. This is one very small piece, a very big puzzle and picture. So, Carlin, all the luck, June. That's it. So, but backstage, is it sort of bothering anything? That was got... very sentimental. It was, wasn't it? Were you expecting that? Or was that Not at all. Or were you just I was just about to say, there's a lot of, there's, there's a lot of, um, there's a lot of like, animosity, but people are a bit up their own asses in bodybuilding. Um, I knew me and Corey competing against each other went uh, last in 2019 at Hampshire. Corey won the award at that show. Um, and since then we spoke on and off, obviously on Instagram, whatever. Um, and come here, obviously we spoke, lean up to the show, met up and whatever. But there's a lot of animosity, obviously, us two, under Cuba, work together and stuff like that. So it's nice to obviously make friends with bodybuilding as well. Come on, Kay, relax. Enjoy Don't it. Smile. Enjoy it. Long intro. <laughs> has, it, has it got your attention? Nice and tight! Yes! Hold it! Yes! Glutes! Yes! That's it, Colton! Come on! Three one five, Carlton Griffin. Second place, could we take the award to number 319, Drew Walker, meaning our winner, coming back for the overall is number 316, Daniel Mabu. Muscular for the cameraman, please. So uh, I've made top five. Um, very, very good class. I'm very happy with the, with the placing. Even if I get top, even if it's five, I don't care. There's, I think there's 12 or 14 guys in the class. Very, very good quality. Some former British champions here. Um, people have been chasing pro cards and stuff. I held my own, done well. Um, we know what we need to work on. So now it's going to go back and do routine. Um, but very, very happy. Um, we'll get some footage of routine after this. And then it's food time, chill, and reassess. But right now, Buzzing, absolutely buzzing. Can't tell you how much. So, fifth place wrapped up, finished. I thought I could have got fourth, but I'm not going to complain about it. But it is what it is. Very, very good. The whole gang's come. Feed everyone donuts. Shout out, Cuba, shout out Cuba for the donuts. Um, so, yeah, we're probably going to get some food now and I'll uh, speak about it when, it when it does settle a bit more. But shout out everyone for coming. Thank you all very much. I appreciate it. Yeah, man. Big up, man. Yeah, fifth man. place, not bad at all, not bad at all. Show it up, man. You have another one? I don't have one yet. No. I don't know about my That's it, we're off to get food. The whole gang, we're everyone here getting food, we're ready to go. Gang, everyone say hello for the YouTube. Yo, YouTube. G -G -G's. At least the sun's up. We're off to get some food now. Nando's, let's go. Time to eat, boy. Gang shit. Waiting for Nando's table. Oh. Mum's even a trophy on. Cheers, thank you. Cheers, 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 cheers. Hold on, Colton. Yeah, feasting with the gang. Yeah, man. Everyone's eating good, even me for once. H is always eating good. Don't get me in it. Don't tell Cuba, he's 10 kilos up in two weeks. Me and Sumo are going to Harlem there. Colton and Mash each. Some halloumi sticks.
back in the car on the way home, uh, Nando went down a treat, um, controlled myself quite well, didn't go massively overboard, could have ate a lot, lot more, but we've uh, learned the hard way in the past about overeating, so I've um, had a little bit, I'm satisfied for now, I've put all the treats and good stuff in my parents' car, so I can't sit and gorge on it now, because I would have done 100%. Once I start, my off switch is hard, um, I'm, I'm human, I have emotions, I have cravings, I, I'm not a robot, I love food as well, um, so, Played it safe, put all the good stuff in their car. Um, home, couple hours drive home now, just relax, let the food soak in, absorb, um, decide if we're gonna eat anything else later or not. But for now, while this is settling, we've had the conversation. Um, where do we go from here? We're gonna just chill out for today, tonight, um, have some breakfast tomorrow, um, see if we're gonna train or not. It, the, the ball's in my court right now, what I wanna do. Um, if I was to say off a win right now, I personally think I need time to grow, I need time to, um, the only feedback I got from multiple people I spoke to today is you have almost everything where it needs to be, just not big enough. So um, in terms of my symmetry, in terms of um, the lines, the, the condition, everything's there, I'm just not big enough yet. And I knew that anyway going to show you. If you go back to the first YouTube video, literally the, the intro one, I said I have no expectations apart from to see where I fall and see what, needs to work, what I need to work on. And that is what I've done today. Um, I'm absolutely buzzing with the result. Um, the feedback I got, obviously straight away from someone was you didn't really like you enjoyed it, and it threw me off. It was completely different to any other show I've done. The way it was ran, the backstage stuff, everything was completely different. I backstage on my own for a lot of the time, um, and it, just, it, it did throw me off a little bit, I can't lie. Um, but now I've come off and the dust has settled, I've looked at the comparisons of the, the lads I was with, and I wasn't blown away, which for me, was what I wanted to do. Um, I've, kept, I've I've gone, um, I've stood on stage with people that have been British champions at Two Bros, that have been pro car chasing, um, that are lads that are a lot older than me, got a lot more tissue than me, that have filled the weight categories, that I've seen do heavyweights and now drop back down to light heavyweights. Um, so I am absolutely over the moon with what I brought. Um, I will, I'm waffling, so I'm gonna shut up. I will summarize my thoughts a little bit. We're gonna have a more of a chat on the way home, see what's what. Reply to my phone has gone off. So if you've messaged me or you, you have messaged me or whatever, the, the, the support has been overwhelmingly humbling. Um, it, honestly, it's, it, it's nuts to think that that many people are watching. Um, but right now I'm gonna shut up. Someone, do you have anything to say to the people? Well done, you smashed it. But yeah, you did need to enjoy it a little bit more, but you said you enjoyed it, so that's the main thing. Um, but yeah, good day out. Yeah, very, very good day. Um, Back to drawing board with Cuba probably um, tomorrow or Tuesday. Um, I spoke to them today, obviously, already. If you said, just enjoy yourself, relax a little bit, and we'll go back to the drawing board. Right now, relax, chill out, um, keep hydrating, and then we shall see where we go to when we go home. Um, and I shall take you with me. But for now, let's drive the fuck home and chill out, boy. Bed is set up, ready though. So, tan washed off, belly nice and full. Um, we actually had, we had a pizza, we only got a pizza, I shared mum and dad. Um, had another donut, which had nuts in it, made me feel sick, I don't like nuts. Um, but other than that, um, we stopped off at the services, got a drink, got some more water. To be fair, we both been massively dehydrated. Um, we've just been trying to smash some water in. Went out, got, got like another 5k steps in just to help digest some food. Felt a bit better for doing that. Um, now the day is done. Still head firmly up my own arse, if I'm honest, in terms of what's next. Um, so what I'm going to do is sleep on it. Um, I should probably take you on the morning walk with in the morning. We are training early doors tomorrow, legs, because um, we're hardcore bodybuilders, brah. Now nah, it's Monday, leg day. Harry's off work as well. Um, so we are just going to go get legs in in the morning um, and then be have a bit more of a chill that afternoon, evening to the day rather than the normal train time is four o'clock and when you train at four o'clock on a day off, it's just a bit hit and miss because you end up lose, you end up watching the time to pre-work out in the order and you're, you're just shit. Um, so it's super quite well hurried off. We are going to get that in. So I will think I will wrap up the video tomorrow. Pete is going to collect the GoPro to, on, on Monday and then he will start editing the other vlogs and whatever so i can wrap up tomorrow um have a bit more of a leveled head on what's going to be the plan um and then we shall see you for morning steps last words <laughs> bedtime
so we are out it is 7 43 the alarms went off at seven um not anything not because oh we're hard on bodybuilders we're getting steps in fasted steps very rare one it's part of our routine and um even though it sounds sad we quite enjoy routine in some respects like that two um we are training earlier to make our day nicer for ourselves so we're training at half nine um legs because we're hard because we're bodybuilders oh rah. um no it's just fell on you monday <laughs> this is fell on monday with lamp of shit um it's just fell on monday monday is legs um so we're just cracking on routine as normal h is off look there makes the day a lot not nicer um so i still feel dehydrated to fuck so i had my hydromax this morning first thing summers i may start as always um, I'm getting this edge of fitting me water in now while I'm walking. Plan of attack is um, I'm never a breakfast person, ever. 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 I, I have to eat breakfast on my own because you don't enjoy it while I eat with your dad. <laughs> yeah, I don't eat, I'm not a breakfast man at all. But every day on my walk, I've been doing my walk, I've been walking past this little green deli place. If you know Firmiston, the little green deli in the village, little hut like a, just parked up there. Um, and it smells good. So I'm going to have a breakfast cob this morning. Because I fancied it for like the last six weeks. Just one cop. Um, something I've learned and someone has to remind me of post show is um, I'm better to eat little and often. So if I fancy a few things, grab some food. If I fancy a few things um, that I want, have something little and often rather than just gorge on one massive thing. So rather than having one massive meal of something, I have a little bits of everything I fancy for that day. And that gets my food focus away quicker. Um, so I'm just gonna have one cup this morning before we go train train and then we shall see what plays from there but as a quick summary wrap up right now still on cloud nine um still none the wiser of where we go in terms of shows and um, stuff like that but i am 0.3 kilo down this morning still tight as fuck my legs are still dry um body midsection is still dry stomach still in so very very happy um i've done they're checking for myself, even though Cubes I didn't have to. I've checked in myself again, routine, got up, trunks on, got the camera out, um, tripod out, off we go. Um, overall, you will have to wait for the next video. I'm going to clickbait it to the next one um, for my like my overall wrap up, my thoughts, and the what plans next. But thank you for watching. I don't know how these two vlogs are going to come out. Um, we've recorded shit loads of footage on this GoPro. Um, until it died. Yeah, until it died. And we've recorded shitloads more. <laughs> we filled this, I think, a 64 gig card with uh, recordings. I don't know how long they're going to be, I don't know how short they're going to be, I don't know the angles, the light, you know, whatever. Um, but literally on Friday morning's walk, I said summer, um, before we know it, we were back walking the streets on Monday morning um, with everything all done and all wrapped up. And here we are. So the weekend has been a fucking blast. I've enjoyed it. I'm happy with the placing, I'm happy with how I looked. Um, 16 week prep finished um, right now chill steps breakfast cob train legs rest days ours to do whatever the fuck we want apart from cook food because I'm bodybuilder I have to prep food for work tomorrow because it's back to reality and that's it anything to add this week the weekend's been good it's always a mazer ain't it it's always a vibe yeah, um, yeah it's been great you've done well you're happy yeah. Time to think about what you want to do next and maybe go eat some food. More food. <laughs> Yesterday, we, so we, we left there, had the Nando's you see, and um, travelled back up all sorts of my dad's car, which is a, a very good thing. Pulled up at services, um, we got uh, some more water because we were dehydrated, had some popcorn chicken between us, um, and then we got back in the car. Um, I think I had cheese and pickle sandwich that my dad had made for himself. <laughs> I love cheese and pickle sandwiches. Um, a packet of crisps, I think. Came back and was um and on what to eat, do we eat, do we not eat? Um, ended up having, went out and got Domino's. Cheese bag of pizza was probably the best, I yeah, think. Cheese bag of pizza. Um, we, had, we had two large pizzas, split into four. Um, but yeah, cheese bag of pizza was the one. I like the veggie supreme and the... So, uh, so every time we go, <laughs> every time we go, um, watch the cyclists. Every time we go uh, Domino's, we have a veggie supreme, minus the mushroom, and add roast chicken. Um, <laughs> Work that out. <laughs> it's a good one, you get more veg on it and stuff like that, but you take mushrooms off because some of that mushroom, cooks mushroom. Okay. Anyway, waffling, waffling, waffling. Wrap to the video, done. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, share. We should be back with more Over and out. very, very soon.